Um, last year at the competition, I was, was kind of nervous because there's lots of people there. And it's like I never did, did uh, read like this before in front of so many people. So I was kind of <sighs> kind of nervous about that. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. قد سمع الله قول التي تجادلك في زوجها وتشتكي إلى الله والله يسمع تحاوركما إن الله سميع بصير when I first walked on stage before, I was very nervous and I closed my eyes and, and like I was looking at the Quran and the people, oh, there was a lot of people I saw when I opened my eyes, so I keep closing my eyes. I just read like this. My eyes looks like it's open because I open it a little bit so I can barely see the people. Um, This year it's going to be harder, inshallah, and there's there's going to be more people, inshallah. So it's going to be more of a competition, and it's not going to be as easy as last year. But inshallah, inshallah, I'll, I'll win again. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. سبح لله ما في السماوات وما في الأرض وهو العزيز الحكيم أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم فكان عاقبتهما أنهما في النار خالدين فيها وذلك جزاء الظالمين Bismillah wa salatu wa salam ala rasulillah wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. Uh, I'm honored to tell you about the upcoming event for Daru Tartil. And Daru Tartil is our um, have the program, the full-time have the program at the Masjid of Abu Huraira Center. We are going to have the students of Daru Tartil only competing, uh, competing uh, in Quran competition. Uh, primarily, we're going to be looking at the have and the Tijweed. And plus something that has not been done uh, around the city, which is the translation or the tafsir of the Qur'an. So these are the three things that will be competing, inshallah, if Allah wills. It's the second year of the Qur'an competition, and they're going to go really hard, 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 hard. I'm going to be, I'm going to try to do my best in front of everybody, especially those who are listening to me. I feel like maybe I'm going to win, inshallah. Maybe I'm going to lose, but I'm still going to learn the Quran. So some of the students do well. Um, they come early and they work harder. And others, they need a little bit of push. Uh, from the parents, from the management, uh, the school administration, from the teacher, from their peers. Absolutely. This event, the the uh, Daru Tartil second annual um, Quran competition, definitely helps. Um, when the student knows the prizes that we put out there for them, and they're very, very good prizes. Uh, the top students are sent to overseas programs to learn the deen, to learn the language, the Arabic language. And we also offer uh, Umrah program. So, uh, Alhamdulillah, this event alone prepares them to excel, definitely. It, it helps them, no doubt about that. Dar Tirti really set the bar for us for the Quran classes. Alhamdulillah, since we started Dar Quran last year, September, and now it's not even two years, and Alhamdulillah, the first two students finished their Quran. So. That of itself, achievements, it motivates really everybody else. We see adults coming in and they want to start the Quran classes. Uh, we see parents are also, you know, asking and, you know, for their kids to be part of this program. And uh, next year, hopefully, inshallah, we'll be also expanding more. So it's really became a, a pillar program 
of the masjid and, uh, and one of the most successful programs that we have here. My name is Hafsa Hassan and I'm inviting you to the 2015 Quran competition this year at Abu Dhabi. My name is Mirsab and I'm inviting you to the 2015 Quran competition. My name is Rayan and I'm inviting you to the 2015 Quran competition. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Omar and I'm inviting you to the 2015 Quran competition.